Mechanism design is a field in economics and game theory that takes an engineering approach to designing economic mechanisms or incentives, toward desired objectives, in strategic settings, where players act rationally. Because it starts at the end of the game, then goes backwards, it is also called reverse game theory. It has broad applications, from economics and politics markets, auctions, voting procedures to networked systems internet interdomain routing, sponsored search auctions. Mechanism design studies solution concepts for a class of private information games. Leonid Hurich explains that in a design problem, the goal function is the main given, while the mechanism is the unknown. Therefore, the design problem is the inverse of traditional economic theory, which is typically devoted to the analysis of the performance of a given mechanism. So, two distinguishing features of these games are that a game designer chooses the game structure rather than inheriting one that the designer is interested in the game's outcome. 2007 Nobel Memorial Prize in Economic Sciences was awarded to Leonid Hurich, Eric Maskin, and Roger Meyerson, "...for having laid the foundations of mechanism design theory". Intuition <inaudible> 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 In an interesting class of Bayesian games, one player, called the principal, would like to condition his behavior on information privately known to other players. For example, the principal would like to know the true quality of a used car a salesman is pitching. He cannot learn anything simply by asking the salesman, because it is in his interest to distort the truth. However, in mechanism design the principal does have one advantage, he may design a game whose rules can influence others to act the way he would like. Without mechanism design theory, the principal's problem would be difficult to solve. He would have to consider all the possible games and choose the one that best influences other players' tactics. In addition, the principal would have to draw conclusions from agents who may lie to him. Thanks to mechanism design, and particularly the revelation principle, the principal only needs to consider games in which agents truthfully report their private information. Foundations. Topic. Mechanism A game of mechanism design is a game of private information in which one of the agents, called the principal, chooses the payoff structure. Following Harshani 1967, the agents receive secret «messages» from nature containing information relevant to payoffs. For example, a message may contain information about their preferences or the quality of a good for sale. We call this information the agents. Type, usually noted, theta, display style theta, and accordingly the space of types, theta, display style theta. Agents then report a type to the principal, usually noted with a hat, theta, caret, display style hat theta. That can be a strategic lie. After the report, the principal and the agents are paid according to the payoff structure the principal chose. The timing of the game is the principal commits to a mechanism y display style y that grants an outcome y display style y as a function of reported type the agent's report possibly dishonestly a type profile theta caret display style hat theta the mechanism is executed agents receive outcome y Theta caret display style y hat theta. In order to understand who gets what, it is common to divide the outcome y display style y into a goods allocation and a money transfer y theta equals x theta t theta x element of x t element of t display style y theta equals x theta t theta x in x t in t where x display style x stands for an allocation of goods rendered or received as a function of type and t display style t stands for a monetary transfer as a function of type 
As a benchmark the designer often defines what would happen under full information. Define a social choice function f theta display style f theta mapping the true type profile directly to the allocation of goods received or rendered f theta theta x display style f theta theta right arrow x in contrast a mechanism maps the reported type profile to an outcome again both a goods allocation x display style x and a money transfer t display style t y theta caret theta y display style y hat theta theta right arrow y topic revelation principle A proposed mechanism constitutes a Bayesian game, a game of private information, and if it is well behaved, the game has a Bayesian Nash equilibrium. At equilibrium, agents choose their reports strategically as a function of type theta caret theta. Display style hat theta theta. It is difficult to solve for Bayesian equilibria in such a setting because it involves solving for agents' best response strategies and for the best inference from a possible strategic lie. Thanks to a sweeping result called the revelation principle, no matter the mechanism a designer can confine attention to equilibria in which agents truthfully report type. The revelation principle states, "...to every Bayesian-Nash equilibrium there corresponds a Bayesian game with the same equilibrium outcome but in which players truthfully report type." This is extremely useful. The principle allows one to solve for a Bayesian equilibrium by assuming all players truthfully report type subject to an incentive compatibility constraint. In one blow it eliminates the need to consider either strategic behavior or lying. Its proof is quite direct. Assume a Bayesian game in which the agent's strategy and payoff are functions of its type and what others do. U I S I theta I S minus I theta minus I theta I display style u underscore I left s underscore I theta underscore I s underscore I theta underscore I theta underscore I right. By definition, agent I's equilibrium strategy s theta I display style s theta underscore I is Nash in expected utility S I theta I element of arg max S I element of S I theta minus I P theta minus I theta I U I S I S minus I theta minus I theta I Display style S underscore I theta underscore I in arg max underscore S underscore I in S underscore I sum underscore theta underscore I P theta underscore I mid theta underscore I U underscore I left S underscore I S underscore I theta underscore I theta underscore I right Simply define a mechanism that would induce agents to choose the same equilibrium. The easiest one to define is for the mechanism to commit to playing the agent's equilibrium strategies for them. Y theta carrot theta s theta y display style y hat theta theta right arrow s theta right arrow y under such a mechanism the agents of course find it optimal to reveal type since the mechanism plays the strategies they found optimal anyway formally choose y theta display style y theta such that theta i element of arg max theta i element of theta theta minus i 
p theta minus i theta i u i y theta i theta minus i theta i equals theta minus i p theta minus i theta i u i s i theta s minus i theta minus i theta i display style begin align theta underscore i in and arg max underscore theta underscore i in theta sum underscore theta underscore i p theta underscore i mid theta underscore i u underscore i left y theta underscore i theta underscore i theta underscore i right five p t and equals sum underscore theta underscore i p theta underscore i mid theta under Underscore I U underscore I left S underscore I theta S underscore I theta underscore I theta underscore I right end aligned Topic Implementability The designer of a mechanism generally hopes either to design a mechanism Y Display style Y that implements a social choice function to find the mechanism y display style y that maximizes some value criterion eg profit to implement a social choice function f theta display style f theta is to find some t theta display style t theta transfer function that motivates agents to pick outcome x theta display style x theta formally if the equilibrium strategy profile under the mechanism maps to the same goods allocation as a social choice function f theta equals x theta caret theta display style f theta equals x left hat theta theta right we say the mechanism implements the social choice function. Thanks to the revelation principle, the designer can usually find a transfer function t theta display style t theta to implement a social choice by solving an associated truth-telling game. If agents find it optimal to truthfully report type theta caret theta equals theta Display style hat theta theta equals theta. We say such a mechanism is truthfully implementable or just implementable. The task is then to solve for a truthfully implementable t theta. Display style t theta, and impute this transfer function to the original game. An allocation x theta. Display style x theta is truthfully implementable if there exists a transfer function t theta display style t theta such that u x theta t theta theta u x theta caret t theta caret theta 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 caret element of theta display style u x theta t theta theta g e q u x hat theta t hat theta theta for all theta hat theta in theta which is also called the incentive compatibility ic constraint in applications the ic condition is the key to describing the shape of t theta display style t theta in any useful way under certain conditions it can even isolate the transfer function analytically additionally a participation individual rationality constraint is sometimes added if agents have the option of not playing topic <laughs> necessity consider a setting in which all agents have a type contingent utility function u x t theta display style u x t theta consider also a goods allocation x theta display style x theta that is vector valued and size 
k display style k which permits k display style k number of goods and assume it is piecewise continuous with respect to its arguments the function x theta display style x theta is implementable only if k equals 1 n theta u x k u t x theta 0 display style sum underscore k equals 1 caret n frac partial partial theta left frac partial u partial x underscore k left partial u partial t right right frac partial x partial theta geq 0 whenever x equals x theta display style x equals x theta and t equals t theta display style t equals t theta and x is continuous at theta display style theta this is a necessary condition and is derived from the first and second order conditions of the agent's optimization problem assuming truth telling its meaning can be understood in two pieces the first piece says the agent's marginal rate of substitution misses increases as a function of the type theta u x k u t equals theta m r s x t Display style frac partial partial theta left frac partial u partial x underscore k left partial u partial t right right equals frac partial partial theta mathrm misses underscore x t. In short, agents will not tell the truth if the mechanism does not offer higher agent types a better deal. Otherwise, higher types facing any mechanism that punishes high types for reporting will lie and declare they are lower types, violating the truth-telling IC constraint. The second piece is a monotonicity condition waiting to happen. X theta display style frac partial x partial theta, which to be positive means higher types must be given more of the good. There is potential for the two pieces to interact. If for some type range the contract offered less quantity to higher types x theta 0 display style partial x partial theta it is possible the mechanism could compensate by giving higher types a discount but such a contract already exists for low type agents so this solution is pathological such a solution sometimes occurs in the process of solving for a mechanism in these cases it must be ironed in a multiple good environment it is also possible for the designer to reward the agent with more of one good to substitute for less of another e.g. butter for margarine multiple good mechanisms are an ongoing problem in mechanism design theory topic sufficiency mechanism design papers usually make two assumptions to ensure implementability one theta u x k u t greater than 0 k display style 1 frac partial partial theta frac partial u partial x underscore k left partial u partial t right greater than 0 for all k this is known by several names the single crossing condition the sorting condition and the spence merleys condition it means the utility function is of such a shape that the agent's misses is increasing in type 2 k 0 k 1 such that u x k u t k 0 plus k 1 t Display style two exists k underscore zero k underscore one text such that left frac partial u partial x underscore k partial u partial t right leq k underscore zero plus k underscore one t. This is a technical condition bounding the rate of growth of the misses. These assumptions are sufficient to provide that any monotonic x theta display style x theta is implementable a t theta 
display style t theta exists that can implement it in addition in the single good setting the single crossing condition is sufficient to provide that only a monotonic x theta display style x theta is implementable so the designer can confine his search to a monotonic x theta display style x theta topic highlighted results topic revenue equivalence theorem Vickrey 1961 gives a celebrated result that any member of a large class of auctions assures the seller of the same expected revenue and that the expected revenue is the best the seller can do. This is the case if the buyers have identical valuation functions which may be a function of type the buyers types are independently distributed the buyers types are drawn from a continuous distribution the type distribution bears the monotone hazard rate property the mechanism sells the good to the buyer with the highest valuation the last condition is crucial to the theorem an implication is that for the seller to achieve higher revenue he must take a chance on giving the item to an agent with a lower valuation usually this means he must risk not selling the item at all topic <laughs> vickrey clark groves mechanisms The Vickrey 1961 auction model was later expanded by Clark 1971 and Groves to treat a public choice problem in which a public project's cost is borne by all agents, e.g. whether to build a municipal bridge. The resulting, Vickrey Clark Groves mechanism can motivate agents to choose the socially efficient allocation of the public good even if agents have privately known valuations. In other words, it can solve the tragedy of the commons. Under certain conditions, in particular quasi-linear utility or if budget balance is not required. Consider a setting in which I number of agents have quasi-linear utility with private valuations V x t theta display style V x t theta where the currency t display style t is valued linearly the vcg designer designs an incentive compatible hence truthfully implementable mechanism to obtain the true type profile from which the designer implements the socially optimal allocation x i theta element of argmax x element of x i element of i V x theta i display style x underscore i caret asterisk theta in underset x in x operator name argmax sum underscore i in i v x theta underscore i. The cleverness of the VCG mechanism is the way it motivates truthful revelation. It eliminates incentives to misreport by penalizing any agent by the cost of the distortion he causes. Among the reports the agent may make, the VCG mechanism permits a null report saying he is indifferent to the public good and cares only about the money transfer. This effectively removes the agent from the game. If an agent does choose to report a type, the VCG mechanism charges the agent a fee if his report is pivotal, that is if his report changes the optimal allocation x so as to harm other agents. The payment is calculated t i theta Carrot equals J element of I minus I V J X I minus I theta I minus I theta J minus J element of I minus I V J X I theta carrot I theta I theta J 
Display style t underscore i hat theta equals sum underscore j in i i v underscore j x underscore i i caret asterisk theta underscore i i theta underscore j sum underscore j in i i v underscore j x underscore i caret asterisk hat theta underscore i theta underscore i theta underscore j, which sums the distortion in the utilities of the other agents and not his own caused by one agent reporting. Topic: Gibbard satterthwaite theorem. Gibbard 1973 and Satterthwaite 1975 give an impossibility result similar in spirit to Arrow's impossibility theorem. For a very general class of games, only dictatorial social choice functions can be implemented. A social choice function f is dictatorial if one agent always receives his most favored goods allocation. For f theta i element of i such that u i x theta i u i x theta i x element of x display style text for f theta text exists i in i text such that u underscore i x theta underscore i g e q u underscore i x theta underscore i for all x in x the theorem states that under general conditions any truthfully implementable social choice function must be dictatorial x is finite and contains at least three elements preferences are rational f theta equals x display style f theta equals x topic Meyerson Satterthwaite theorem Meyerson and Satterthwaite 1983 show there is no efficient way for two parties to trade a good when they each have secret and probabilistically varying valuations for it without the risk of forcing one party to trade at a loss it is among the most remarkable negative results in economics a kind of negative mirror to the fundamental theorems of welfare economics. Examples Price discrimination Murley's introduces a setting in which the transfer function t is easy to solve for. Due to its relevance and tractability it is a common setting in the literature. Consider a single good, single agent setting in which the agent has quasi-linear utility with an unknown type parameter theta display style theta u x t theta equals v x theta minus t display style u x t theta equals v x theta t and in which the principal has a prior CDF over the agent's type p theta. Display style p theta. The principal can produce goods at a convex marginal cost c x and wants to maximize the expected profit from the transaction max x theta t theta e theta t theta minus c x theta display style max underscore x theta t theta math b e underscore theta left t theta c left x theta right right subject to ic and ir conditions u x theta t theta theta u x theta T theta 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 display style u x theta t theta theta g e q u x theta t theta theta for all theta theta u x theta t theta theta u underscore theta theta 
Display style u x theta t theta theta g e q underline u theta for all theta. The principle here is a monopolist trying to set a profit-maximizing price scheme in which it cannot identify the type of the customer. A common example is an airline setting fares for business, leisure, and student travelers. Due to the IR condition, it has to give every type a good enough deal to induce participation. Due to the IC condition it has to give every type a good enough deal that the type prefers its deal to that of any other. A trick given by Murley's is to use the envelope theorem to eliminate the transfer function from the expectation to be maximized let u theta equals max theta u x theta t theta theta display style text let u theta equals max underscore theta u left x theta t theta theta right d u d theta equals u theta equals v theta Display style frac do d theta equals frac partial u partial theta equals frac partial v partial theta. Integrating u theta equals u underscore theta zero plus theta zero theta v theta tilde d theta tilde display style u theta equals underline u theta underscore 0 plus in underscore theta underscore 0 caret theta frac partial v partial tilde theta d tilde theta where theta 0 display style theta underscore 0 is some index type replacing the incentive compatible T theta equals V X theta theta minus U theta display style T theta equals V X theta theta U theta in the maximum E theta V X theta theta minus U underscore theta zero minus theta zero theta v theta tilde d theta tilde minus c x theta Display style math b e underscore theta left v x theta theta underline u theta underscore zero int underscore theta underscore zero caret theta frac partial v partial tilde theta d tilde theta c left x theta right right equals e theta v x theta theta minus u underscore theta zero minus one minus P theta P theta V theta minus C X theta Display style equals Math B E underscore theta left V x theta theta underline U theta underscore zero FRAC one P theta P theta FRAC partial V partial theta C left x theta right right after an integration by parts. This function can be maximized pointwise. Because U theta Display style U theta is incentive compatible already the designer can drop the IC constraint. If the utility function satisfies the Spence Murley's condition, then a monotonic x theta display style x theta function exists. The IR constraint can be checked at equilibrium and the fee schedule raised or lowered accordingly. 
Additionally, note the presence of a hazard rate in the expression. If the type distribution bears the monotone hazard ratio property, the FOC is sufficient to solve for T. If not, then it is necessary to check whether the monotonicity constraint C sufficiency, above, is satisfied everywhere along the allocation and fee schedules. If not, then the designer must use Meyerson ironing. Meyerson ironing In some applications the designer may solve the first order conditions for the price and allocation schedules yet find they are not monotonic. For example, in the quasi-linear setting this often happens when the hazard ratio is itself not monotone. By the spence murleys condition the optimal price and allocation schedules must be monotonic, so the designer must eliminate any interval over which the schedule changes direction by flattening it. Intuitively, what is going on is the designer finds it optimal to bunch certain types together and give them the same contract. Normally the designer motivates higher types to distinguish themselves by giving them a better deal. If there are insufficiently few higher types on the margin the designer does not find it worthwhile to grant lower types a concession called their information rent in order to charge higher types a type-specific contract. Consider a monopolist principle selling to agents with quasi-linear utility, the example above. Suppose the allocation schedule x theta satisfying the first order conditions has a single interior peak at theta 1 display style theta underscore 1 and a single interior trough at theta 2 greater than theta 1 display style theta underscore 2 greater than theta underscore 1 illustrated at right following Meyerson 1981 flatten it by choosing X display style X Satisfying Phi two X Phi one X V X X theta minus one minus P theta P theta two V theta X X Theta minus C X X D theta equals zero. Display style int underscore phi underscore two x caret phi underscore one x left frac partial v partial x x theta frac one p theta p theta frac partial caret two v partial theta partial x x theta frac partial c partial x x right d theta equals 0 where phi 1 x display style phi underscore 1 x is the inverse function of x mapping to theta theta 1 display style theta leq theta underscore 1 and phi 2 x Display style phi underscore two x is the inverse function of x mapping to theta theta two display style theta geq theta underscore two that is phi one display style phi underscore one returns a theta display style theta before the interior peak and phi Two display style phi underscore two returns a theta display style theta after the interior trough if the nonmonotonic region of x theta display style x theta borders the edge of the type space simply set the appropriate phi x display style phi x function or both to the boundary type. If there are multiple regions, see a textbook for an iterative procedure. It may be that more than one troughs should be ironed together. Topic: <laughs> Proof. The proof uses the theory of optimal control. It considers the set of intervals 
theta underscore theta display style left underline theta overline theta right in the nonmonotonic region of x theta display style x theta over which it might flatten the schedule it then writes a hamiltonian to obtain necessary conditions for a x theta display style x theta within the intervals that does satisfy monotonicity for which the monotonicity constraint is not binding on the boundaries of the interval condition 2 ensures that the x theta display style x theta satisfying the optimal control problem reconnects to the schedule in the original problem at the interval boundaries no jumps any x theta display style x theta satisfying the necessary conditions must be flat because it must be monotonic and yet reconnect at the boundaries as before maximize the principal's expected payoff but this time subject to the monotonicity constraint x theta 0 display style frac partial x partial theta geq 0 and use a hamiltonian to do it with shadow price new theta display style new theta h equals v x theta minus u underscore theta 0 minus 1 minus p theta p theta v theta x theta minus c x p theta plus nu theta x theta Display style h equals left v x theta underline u theta underscore zero frac one p theta p theta frac partial v partial theta x theta c x right p theta plus nu theta frac partial x partial theta, where x display style x is a state variable and x theta display style partial x partial theta the control as usual in optimal control the costate evolution equation must satisfy new theta equals minus h x equals minus v x x theta minus 1 minus P theta P theta two V theta X X theta minus C X X P theta Display style FRAC partial new partial theta equals FRAC partial H partial X equals left FRAC partial V partial X X theta FRAC one P theta P theta FRAC partial carrot two V partial theta partial X X the Ta FRAC partial C partial X X right P theta Taking advantage of condition two, note the monotonicity constraint is not binding at the boundaries of the theta display style theta interval new theta underscore equals new theta equals zero display style new underline theta equals new overline theta equals zero meaning the costate variable condition can be integrated and also equals 0 theta underscore theta v x x theta minus 1 minus p theta p theta 2 v theta x x theta minus c 
x x p theta d theta equals 0 display style int underscore underline theta caret overline theta left frac partial v partial x x theta frac 1p theta p theta frac partial caret 2v partial theta partial x x theta frac partial c partial x x right p theta d theta equals 0 the average distortion of the principal surplus must be 0 to flatten the schedule find an x display style x such that its inverse image maps to a theta display style theta interval satisfying the condition above topic see also topic notes topic references Clark, Edward H. 1971. Multipart pricing of public goods. PDF. Public Choice. 11 1, 17 to 33. DOI 101007 bf 01726210 JSTOR 30022651. Jabard, Allen. 1973. Manipulation of voting schemes: a general result. PDF. Econometrica. 41 4, 587 to 601. DOI 102307 1914083 JSTOR 1914083 Groves, Theodore. 1973. Incentives in Teams. PDF. Econometrica. 41 4, 617 to 631. Doi 10.2307/1914085. JSTOR 1914085. Harshani, John C. Games with incomplete information played by Bayesian players. I3 Part 1: The Basic Model. Management Science Special Issue Theory Series. Informs 14:3159-182. DOI 10.1287/mnsc/14.3.159. JSTOR 2628393. Murleys, J. A. An Exploration in the Theory of Optimum Income Taxation. PDF. Review of Economic Studies. 38 175-208. doi.10.2307.2296779. JSTOR 2296779. Meyerson, Roger B., Satterthwaite, Mark A. Efficient Mechanisms for Bilateral Trading. PDF. Journal of Economic Theory. 29 2, 265 281. DOI 10.1016/0022-0531-83-90048-0. Satterthwaite, Mark Allen. 1975. Strategy Proofness and Arrows Conditions: Existence and Correspondence Theorems for Voting Procedures and Social Welfare Functions. Journal of Economic Theory, 10 187–217. doi, 10. 1016, 0022-0531-75-90050-2. Vickrey, William "'Counterspeculation, Auctions, and Competitive Sealed Tenders'". PDF. The Journal of Finance, 16 8–37. Doi 10.1111 slash j.1540-6261.1961.tbr 2789 X. Topic. Further reading. 
Chapter 7 of Feudenberg, Drew, Tyrrell, Jean 1991, Game Theory, Boston, MIT Press, ASIN 0262061414, ISBN 978-0-262-06141-4 CS1 maint, ASIN uses ISBN link. A standard text for graduate game theory. Chapter 23 of Moss Collel, Winston, Green 1995, Microeconomic Theory, Oxford, Oxford University Press, ISBN 978-0-19-507340-9. A standard text for graduate microeconomics. Milgram, Paul 2004, Putting Auction Theory to Work, New York, Cambridge University Press, ISBN 978-0-521-55184-7. Applications of Mechanism Design Principles in the Context of Auctions. Noam Nissan. A Google Tech Talk on Mechanism Design. Legros, Patrick, Candelon, Estelle. 2007. What is Mechanism Design and Why Does It Matter for Policy Making? Center for Economic Policy Research. Roger B. Meyerson. 2008. Mechanism Design. The New Palgrave Dictionary of Economics Online, Abstract. External links Eric Maskin, Nobel Prize Lecture, delivered on 8 December 2007 at Aula Magna, Stockholm University.